So people always say to me, nah, nah, two days a week isn't enough. You need four days a week, five days a week. They're still under the impression that more is more. More is better. But then those same individuals were not committing themselves to five days a week or they would do it for a month and then completely stop. So if you stop doing that, then you're not doing five days a week. So how can you say that approach is better if you're not even able to execute it? So taking human nature, people are inherently lazy, myself included, and and lazy might be an, an aggressive word for it. Maybe people just don't like to put themselves under stress when there's other options to do on a, on a day-to-day basis. So why not make it easy and attainable? What, you, you can commit yourself to something once a week or twice a week. That is far easier than doing something four days a week or five days a week. And that's probably anything. I would I would go as far as saying that people would struggle doing something enjoyable five days a week just because it's difficult to commit yourself to something like that. And now we're trying to do something non-enjoyable like working out. You know, some people find joy in it, but while you're under the tension of the load, it's not enjoyable, it's uncomfortable, it's hard, it's demanding. How can we get people to do something demanding five days a week? I just don't think it's possible. Maybe to the maybe to five percent or one percent of the population, they can withstand that amount of stress on their body and still do it five days a week. Maybe maybe some can do it, but I would say ninety percent, ninety five percent of the population cannot. <laughs>